58 teams from Southern California are at the Valley View Casino Center getting their robots ready for competition. Some of the teams are new and some are small, but they've all got a shot at coming out on top. High school robotics teams are taking over the sports arena for the ninth year in a row. Some of the teams have as many as 40 members and some, like La Puente High, have as few as five. La Puente is about 40 minutes east of LA. 17-year-old Diego Navarro says his team may be small in number, but they're big in heart. It's, it doesn't really about, matter about the numbers, it just it matters who's working and how much you dedicate towards the robot. Navarro says small teams like his may not have much money, but they have a great experience. So we actually get to know how each piece of, each piece, every item that we have on there, we get to know how it works. We have to manufacture, build, put together everything. So we mainly know more. Xavier Valadorez is from Southwest High near the border. It's their first year in the competition. He says the experienced teams and the big teams support the smaller and newer teams. And everything that we that they do, we can pick up as strategies and tips. I mean, they're just our mentors, our guidance. The organization First Robotics runs the contest. For Inspiration and Recognition of Science and Technology, or FIRST, was founded in 1989 and is spread across the nation. David Berggren from the FIRST Robotics competition says while it is a contest, they have a tradition of cooperation that goes along with the competition. Really supporting each other, sharing ideas, sharing equipment, uh, and really working together. Berggren says the friendly spirit turns the event into almost a carnival. It's sort of uh, parts, you know, uh, sporting events, part, part Comic-Con, uh, you know, part, uh, part robotics competition. This year's contest will have robot teams stacking plastic bins. The contest is free and open to the public Friday and Saturday. The top six teams go on to the first robotics world championship competition in St. Louis at the end of April. Matt Bowler, KPBS News.